subscribing. I see that 90% of the people that watch my videos are not my subscribers. So please do like, share, subscribe. Today I'm gonna, I am creating actually videos about medical, ter medical terminology related to bilingual medical tests which could be STAT, L4, HP STAT, whatsoever, all the companies that will test you nowadays before they hire you, they will need you to know this test in the both languages, English and your target language. So this is video number seven, where I'm going to give you 25 words um, as terminology if you do have the terminology test that is the first part of it eventually they will ask you a word and you have three seconds to give it on the target language and then they will give you another 25 words and you have to give it in english so in this video i'm going to give you about five words 25 let's say it's about 30 actually 30 medical terminology words and they are all messed up because this is how we can receive them on the test. And some of the questionnaires also mess up these things. So you don't have it all easy. They include different questionnaires here of different body types and different uh, body systems. Uh, what I mean is could be question about thyroid gland and the next question could be, have you had a gallbladder removal? So these terminology are messed up so you can exercise your brain to to know them and to be ready for those bilingual medical tests so uh, also before i start do like share subscribe if you do want to take part of my bilingual youtube videos please write me a comment below with your language and i'm gonna schedule a zoom meeting and we're going to make uh, these videos in your language i'm planning myself to do it in four or five languages if god wants as they say in arab inshallah so we're gonna start with uh, our terminology for today the first one is numbness numbness or tingling i repeat or one or the another very rarely you will have them both on the same test uh, as a word but maybe as a symptom you can have it jundice or jundice or this is also called chicken paw or there is something similar no the chicken paw is the one that you have the other things jundice is something with yellowish on the skin if i'm not mistaken i didn't pass this word on my chest because i didn't know what jundice is in english but i know it in my language i know in russian is jaltuha so, поэтому, ну, если вы русский, да, пожалуйста. Um, but it takes time. I, I would like to have somebody in Russian to take part of my bilingual videos. I do speak Russian myself, but I would be so happy to have someone here. So if you do speak Russian, I'm going to be so, so, so happy to have you here on my YouTube channel. So write me a comment below. Heart, heart, gums, gums. Uh, as you see they're messed up you have a heart cardiovascular and then you have a dental this is how they're gonna give it on the test so don't try to memorize them just try to exercise your brain to have them ready right gallbladder gallbladder colon cancer colon cancer i'm giving it mixed but always remember in the test there are going to be some uh, health problems like colon cancer, skin cancer, breast cancer, stroke, uh, I don't know, COPD, there will be something, right? Bone marrow transplant. Okay, I had this in my test. I know what it is. I've been talking about bone marrow. My best friend, when I was 15, had a bone marrow transplant because he had a leukemia. And I know what is it. I know in detail. I know how painful it is to do the puncture in the spine. I, I was feeling so, so bad about this friend that every time he was going to the hospital, I was fearing that he is going to die because he was suffering this terrible thing called leukemia. So make sure you know what is bone marrow and bone marrow transplant. Unfortunately, even if you don't use it as often at work, that could be on the test. Skull, skull, 
acid reflex, acid reflex, outpatient, outpatient, spasm, spasm, itching, itching, chills, chills. Okay, so there is few words here that they love. One is chills, then is tingling. They love these ones on the head. Chicks, chicks, breast feed or breast feeding, uterus, uterus, ovarian tubes, ovarian tubes, fallopian tubes, fallopian tubes, stroke, uh, brain attack, health insurance, health insurance, inner ear canal, inner ear canal, eye glasses, overdose, overdose, over counter, over the counter, there is a word that I am not able to read, <laughs> nausea, nausea and throw up and throw up and nausea and anti anti-inflammatory is the word anti-inflammatory thank you for being here liking sharing subscribing please do write me a comment below and if you did like this video please press your thumbs up thank you and have a good day bye bye